everyone. Welcome back to my channel, Travel Aziz. Today we are going towards the beach that is closest to Jakarta. It's called as Charita Beach. I have my family with me, my son Atharva. Hi. And he is relaxing. There is a complete mattress for him so that he can just sleep on the way if he wants. It is uh, around 174 or 180 kilometers away from Jakarta. I'll show you the water park, I'll show you the hotel, alright, so I'll see you in the coconut island today. After a few minutes of drive from the Jakarta city traffic, we finally reached our first stop which is a rest area on the way. This rest area is only 40 kilometers away from Jakarta and this rest area has all the restaurants where you can eat, drink. We have just stopped on the way, our first stop here for the breakfast. Say hi. Hi. We already drove around 40 kilometers out of Jakarta. This is a restaurant called Simpang Raya, where they serve nasi padang, which is an Indonesian recipe. Very delicious, I am very fond of that. And uh, that is where we are going to have our breakfast today. What all do you want to eat for the breakfast? Uh, I really want to eat some ayam gulai. Uh, I would also like to take some uh, eggs over here. Okay, okay. I would take some namka. So, happy with your breakfast? Yeah. Is it hot? Yeah, pretty hot. But hot is good, right? Yeah, but I don't like it too hot. Otherwise, it will burn my tongue. Yeah, good mix. So that is your vegetarian platter, only the vegetables, no chicken or egg, no, nothing. nothing, only the vegetarian no meat at all. And there it is my breakfast plate, fried chicken, chili sauce, it's called a sambal, vegetables, rice with some chicken gravy. After a long drive, it was finally time to exit the Jakarta Merak Toll Road. On the way to Anir Beach, you can also see Gunung Karang, which is a volcano in the Bantain area. After a long drive from Jakarta, like three and a half hours of drive, we are finally here. Let's go inside and check into our hotel. This is the main entrance of the Coconut Island Resort. This area has got a lot of parking space. If you just look around, there is a lot of parking space. So like maybe more than a thousand people can come here and they can easily park their vehicle without any problem. So let's go inside the resort. Let's do the check-in for our room. And then I will show you the resort and the facilities around. Uh, it's beautiful, looks nice. There is a lot of uh, greenery in this area. This is a nice, beautiful reception area in the restaurant. They have uh, given a complete wooden architecture. Now we will go inside the resort once the check-in is complete and I'll show you the facilities around. The check-in process is complete, already made the payment. They have given us a very nice uh, beach looking villa. Let me take the key and let's walk to our nice villa room. Thank you, Pa. Thank you. That's our beachside villa the cottage that we have rented room number 112 that's the room number of our cottage 
So let's go inside and see how's the room, how the amenities here. Wow, that's a nice room. All wooden stuff, wooden material. So it's pretty beautiful room. A nice queen bed. And because it is a family room, so you also have the bed. So one bed is this side, one more bed is the other side. So you can have two adults and two kids can sleep in this room. Air conditioner, TV with all the satellite channels. You have coffee machine, some free water bottle, some mini fridge there. Yeah, so this room has all the facilities. We have the intercom, another half bed over here for the kids. Cupboard for keeping the clothes and electronic safe also. So if you have some expensive equipments, you can just keep them here while you are out on the beach. This is completely made of wood. Nice lamps. It is going to be a very good vibe in the evening. Wow, the toilet is nice, beautiful. Open roof, so you have a lot of natural light coming in. Water heater, although you don't need a heater here, just beach side, it is mostly hot and humid. Shower. Wash basin, you have your dental kit here, toothpaste, brushes nice beautiful wash basin and of course most important thing the toilet area yeah so overall it is a nice room uh, worth the price uh, they are charging 720 thousand indonesian rupiah for this complete setup for one night and i think it is totally worth it uh, one more thing outside also there is nice sitting area which opens in the backyard so this is the area that opens in the backyard of the hotel they have nice water canals here so you can just sit in the evening have tea or coffee while having a nice view of the hotel surrounding Okay, let's let's go out and now we will go towards the beach area towards the other facilities of the hotel I will show you. So there are so many facilities here in this resort. We are just entering the water park area. So they have the snorkeling, donut boat, banana boat. Tracking Churug Putri. So Churug means the waterfall in the Indonesian language. Trip Pulau Karakatoa. So this is the volcano, the famous Karakatoa volcano. And the trip to Pulau Liwungan. Now we will just go inside the water park. It's not yet open, but we can still see what all kind of facilities do they have here. <music> So that's a beautiful water park. We already have some kids coming in here. It's really a nice view from up here. It's lying in the middle of this water park and you can see everywhere. There is a slide, a tube slide, which is like three, four floors high. So you climb there and you come down in the tube, the typical water slide kind of rides. Some pools for the kids and it's okay. Uh, it's not so luxurious and it is not so high end. We will come here later and enjoy the facilities in the water park. There are some more things to explore it seems here 
Bamboo Villas, Sunset Promenade, Bean Bag Club, Ocean Lake, Sunset Cafe, Rent or Rent. Okay, so let's go that side and explore what all these things are. What is the Bean Bag Club? I am a big fan of the Bean Bags. Sunset Promenade. Okay, so th that is the Sunset Promenade. We see the directions over there. So I guess this is a place from where you can see a nice uh, sunset view. Uh, over there is the ocean. So here I am at the ocean lake. Although you cannot swim here because the beach is kind of rocky. So if you try to swim here, you are going to scratch uh, your whole body. So now we are on the beach end of the resort. This is where the ocean starts. Behind me, you will be able to see the Karakotoa volcano also. But because it is very hazy today and it's also very cloudy, uh, we are not able to see that volcano, otherwise the, the, the dome of the volcano is very much clear uh, from here. This side we also have the swimming pool, which is especially for the hotel guests only. I tried this food here uh, from the roadside shop and found and surprisingly the food is so delicious so I ordered another chicken and rice for myself and one for me and we also bought some soup which in here in Indonesia is called Sayur Asli so ordered another item here at this restaurant it's the uh, ice lemon tea and it's super delicious Mm. Balanced taste, sugar, citrus, wholeness, everything is perfect. Let's have a cup of coffee. Okay, so we have checked out now of the room and just before we start for our journey way back to Jakarta, we want to see the restaurant, just want to taste their food also because yesterday night we couldn't eat here, we went outside. You already saw what kind of experience we had there yesterday. So let's go over to the restaurant. Indonesian taste. That's what we want. No. Ini semua ayam udang sapi. No, nothing, nothing. Sayur sama nasi. Choco. I really like what he, what he was just asking is that is it okay to put some chicken sausages? Yeah, that's something common you will find in Indonesia. That even though. You have clearly explained that you do not want any kind of uh, non veg stuff, but these sausages and some type of uh, uh, sambals, they are not considered to be non-vegetarian, even though there is chicken in it. Yeah. So. Right? <laughs> so if you visit Indonesia, uh, you have to be very precise in yeah. what you want to order. <laughs> okay, so finally, the food is here. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, okay, makasi. All right. Thank you. Okay, so in this we have the sambal. Looks very spicy. Tahu goreng, that is the fried tahu. This is ayam bakar, which is the roasted chicken. 
roasted on flames some white rice and some salad here wow that soup soto ayam looks super delicious yeah <laughs> now let me unwrap the fork and spoon yeah just finished the lunch and it costed us 138000 idr the indonesian rupiah okay so it's time to head back towards home bags are packed the car is ready and uh, we just checked on the map it will take around 3 and a half hours to reach jakarta so by 5 pm we will be home see okay time to go home just stopped on the way while going to jakarta to have some coconut water makasi yeah that is some really nice place to enjoy your coconut water and there is a nice ocean view well it's not so cold little bit warmish but the taste is very nice mm yeah the pulp is super delicious so we stopped in another rest area on the way to jakarta it's like another one and a half hours of journey and 4 or 9 so everybody was feeling hungry mishto was feeling hungry yeah i'm okay. hungry and they have also feeling hungry so we thought to stop in the rest area and this restaurant is something special it's called as cfc so which is like kfc but their menu is very nice they yeah, have very really, yeah they have very uh, nice dishes there it's there is one called as the nasi ayam lada hitam which is the chicken rice but it is the preparation in black pepper sauce and i have tried it several times and it is super delicious what do you think of this rest area i think of this rest area as like a local restaurant okay i think our order is here so that's the orange float for you neha okay you can take your orange float and that's our fried chicken and mostly rice this thing is chicken pop Okay, so chicken, my chicken, and the chicken pop, Coca Cola. I will try this. You don't want to switch? Yes, because this looks bigger. <laughs> so you want a bigger piece for yourself? <laughs> Let's yeah. start eating our fried chicken before it is too cold. Mmm. Mm. The way you are digging into the chicken looks it's yeah. super delicious, right? Yeah, it looks pretty not. Right. These are the chicken deep. pop, some crispy, crunchy chicken balls kind of thing. Very nice. It's Juicy exactly chicken. like chicken, but in pieces. Yep, and it's kind of chewy also. Yeah. Right. It's raining heavily on the way back to Jakarta. Like we just started from the rest area, we finished the meal, and as soon as we came out of the rest area, it's heavy shower. Heavy rainfall because of which there is a bit of traffic jam kind of situation. Finally, we reach Jakarta in the evening, and this fun trip to Coconut Island came to an end. Okay, so guys. So this is my review of Coconut Island Hotel. Coconut Island Hotel. And I hope you like the one-day journey, like the one-day journey, 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 and with a new video if you like this video please hit the like button and also subscribe to my channel if you want to keep visiting such beautiful places in indonesia